Hello everyone, this is Ecolka. Today we will talk about the new 2020 Inmotion V11. Only the lazy one did not review this electric unicycle. Inmotion did an excellent job and really brought a quality product to the market. Let's figure out for whom it was actually made. I will never tire of repeating that there is no perfect electric unicycle or unicycle that would suit absolutely everyone in all conditions of use. Every new model on the market market has a whole list of compromises that you have to put up with. Many people are chasing the newest, fastest, with the longest range, but it is important to understand and ask yourself why you need this. The second day I am using this Inmotion V11 electric unicycle and for now I cannot tell if I am comfortable with it or not. Today I was going from home to work, it is about 30 km and my approximate speed was 32 km per hour. So it is very strange because I went only 30 km and 50% of the battery left and application said that I can go 60 km more. In motion, engineers have completely redesigned the unicycle concept and if you are a fan of this brand, then you have to get used to it and put up with the following things. High pedals. Yes, this is compromise I mentioned above. On the one hand, the chance of touching the surface with the pedal is extremely low due to the height. On the other hand, your center of the gravity is significantly higher, which causes imbalance when driving at very low speeds and trying to turn around in narrow spaces. It will also take some getting used to the height, so this wheel is not quite suitable for beginners. The device is too large. Also, the height of the device is not much different from its counterpart in the same class like Gotway MSP, Kingsong 18XL or in Motion V10F, but due to the impressive height and weight, the unicycle is quite problematic to lift or transport somewhere. And for the people of short statue or girls, it will turn into a serious problem and everyday pain. One more thing that I'm a little bit confused, even that, that it has the same tire as MSP, Gotway MSP. It feels a little bit different. Sensitivity when cornering. I like aggressive riding style and love to corner at high speeds. In the case of V11, I cannot name the exact reason, maybe it is already mentioned, high pedals or too soft suspension, but I do not feel the same stability when cornering as it was at other devices. Maybe because of suspension system, but now it is 120 psi for my 80 kilograms of weight so maybe we will need to change it somehow or maybe it is tire pressure so now i will check tire pressure in my electric unicycle and we'll try to make some changes suspension work i tried different pressures below the recommended and exactly what the manufacturer claims and above the recommended but in any case the suspension operation remains a little indistinct especially this is noticeable either with large jumps for example from a curb or onto a curb or when you have a serious obstacles like let's say bumps on the asphalt from tree roots or large potholes I'm charging it about one and a half hour with original uh, charger and it shows 90 kilometers range but I'm not sure if it is true because if you have really high speed I think we need to double it and the real range will be around 40 maybe 50 kilometers okay, I made the tire pressure to 1.8 and we will see how it will be going on before it was something around 2.1 2.2 but uh, for fast riding, I guess it is not, not so stable, but we will see. Maybe it is not about the tire pressure, maybe it is about suspension system. Why are all bloggers so impressed by Inmotion V11? Simply because it is one of the best wheels ever invented in the history of the industry. Finally, at least someone was able to come close to the build quality and materials of the 9-Bot Z10. Only for this you can buy this wheel. When you see it for the first time, you clearly understand 
what you are pay your money for. This wheel attracts 100% of the attention of others, thanks to its futuristic angel eye in front and the beautiful headlight like laser eyes in the back. The V11 is like a Rolls Royce in the world of electric unicycles. It is heavy, solid and swallows uneven asphalt as if they were not there. You just get up and drive, even on the ground, grass or cobblestones. There are no limits for you and your niece will thank you very much. For me, the V11 is a perfect UAC for measured city ride, when you do not have to concentrate on every crack or hole in the asphalt and think about how to keep your feet on the pedal after the next bounce. You just get up and go, without hesitations or compromises. If 60 km of range is ideal for you, if you are a lover of measured and safe riding, if quality of the materials and workmanship is important to you, then the Inmotion V11 is certainly the right choice that you will definitely not regret. Thank you all for your attention like subscribe and see you in the next videos if you are located in europe you can visit our webpage ekolka.eu we have free shipping to 25 countries of europe with delivery time of two three days and two year warranty for all goods thank you and regards that was ekolka